A smash and grab crime in St. John's County. Glass left on the ground. Deputies searching for a man who they say took thousands of dollars worth of goods from this local store. It all happened at Bubba's Food Mart on Everest Lane early this morning. Tonight, neighboring business owners say they are on guard. News 4 Jacks reporter Eric Avenier joins us live from outside the store in St. John's with a neighborhood crime alert. Eric. Yes, investigators say the crook uh, basically around 1 to 120 this morning uh, smashed the front glass to this store, uh, entered the store, uh, took hundreds of dollars worth of cash, uh, thousands of dollars worth of cigarettes, and even snatched uh, a stack or shall I say a book of lottery tickets. This was the scene around 5 p.m. Thursday as a window repairman replaced the glass door that had been shattered in the early morning hours by a thief. According to St. John's County deputies, that thief was seen on surveillance video smashing this glass door with an unknown object before walking inside and stealing $200 in cash, 120 cartons of cigarettes valued at more than $4,900 and possibly several books of lottery tickets. Afterwards, investigators say the crook left the store in an unknown direction. Neighboring business owners and employees say this was a very unusual crime inside the promenade at Bartram Springs. We have all of these family establishments and to have something like this happen uh, in this area, um, it's, it's, it's scary. It's a very rare occurrence. So it was, it was, you know, uh, something that we were, um, you know, kind of concerned about. The description isn't much, but according to investigators, the crook was wearing khaki pants, a black shirt, and gloves. In the meantime, business owners say they will be keeping a watchful eye for anything suspicious. We've got cameras, so we're we're taking note of things, but we are good neighbors with uh, the folks who this happened to, and we're watching out for them. We're going to support Bubba's, and uh, I think that we'll be fine, but we do need to watch out for anything else that we can do to help make sure something like this doesn't happen again to our community. Now, deputies say one person may have seen a uh, pickup truck, a dark colored pickup truck, leaving this area at a very high rate of speed, even going through a red light. Uh, but they aren't sure if the person driving that truck is the same person who committed this snatch and grab crime. Reporting live in St. John's, Eric Avenier, Channel 4, The Local Station. So, Eric, what's the owner of Bubba's saying about all this? Well, right now, the owner isn't saying anything. In fact, I'm told by one of his employees that he had been up all morning uh, dealing with the, uh, the mess that was left from all of this. And at this point, he was just too tired and just too upset to make any comments. All right, Eric Avignier reporting to us live from St. John's. Thank you, Eric.